Back here in Washington, the White House is pushing back against Republican criticism over the classified documents found at President Biden's home and former office. CBS's Adriana Diaz was the first to break the story, and tonight she has new details about how the president is handling the growing controversy. Will you commit to speak to the special counsel? Today, President Biden did not acknowledge the controversy publicly, but CBS News has learned that privately he's expressed frustration the documents ended up at his home and private office. The White House has been criticized for not being more forthcoming. The first documents were discovered on November 2nd, but the White House didn't acknowledge that until last week after being asked by CBS News. And since then, the White House has said even more documents had been found at another location. Today, White House Press Secretary Karine Jean-Pierre was asked 18 times about the issue. So when it comes to legal issues, uh, we have been very clear that we are not going to comment. Republicans continue to criticize the White House for not going public sooner. Prior to an election, they kept it secret. At no time did he get raided by the FBI. But White House aides are calling that criticism fake outrage, House arguing there was little concern expressed from Republicans when classified documents were found at Mar-a-Lago. And Nora, we have learned tonight that special counsel Robert Hur is expected to begin his investigation into President Biden's classified documents within the next two weeks. Hey, Adriana Diaz, thank you very much.